Hollywood. Here's the game where knowledge is king and Lady Luck is queen. It's the Joker's Wild. And now, here's your host, the star of the Joker's Wild, Brendan Martin. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of right here on my channel. And it's currently got a and head meet and our challenger. Brandon, go ahead and take it away. All right, our contestants for today's game, the challenger comes to us from San Francisco, California. He's a security officer. It's Will Medina and your current reigning champion who's one game cash winnings control of $31,752. It's yours truly, Brandon Scrubs. Welcome in. And Brandon, you currently got, like you said, for your total of $31,752 in cash and prizes for just your one game. Go by the way, Brandon. Um, I felt like I could have done better on my last one, but it was as good of a win as I could get it for the first time around. We're hoping to see if we make things better this second game. All right, well. Well, Brian, best of luck to you. And we have our challenger for this one again. We have, we welcome back Mr. Will Medina from San Francisco, California, a security officer in this one. No, he, he, oh, wait. Yeah, well, well, well. well. He, Show there up and a little bit of some revenge. At this point, that's all I'm saying. So, anyway. Mr. of MVG and uh, let's see what happens. Thanks a lot to everybody here here on this program. This game and oh. and followed by classical music, TV pets. American states and finally deal some useless. You spin those and will unlock your controls and all that. I'll explain what the humorous quotations category is all about. I'll give you a, 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 some humorous quotations and you got to name who said that quote. But that case, with that being said, well, a challenger in this one, you can go ahead and spin. TV pets. Okay, I just want to make sure I was not on mute. Just one. Uh, let's go for uh, TV pets, five hundred one. TV pets for five hundred dollars. Here's your question under TV pets. All right, Will. I want you to name the. Name Homer Simpson's dog from The Simpsons. Again, I want you to name Homer Simpson's dog from The Simpsons. Is it A, Rudolph, B, Santa's little helper, or C, Frosty? <sighs> what? These questions. <laughs> that would be B, Santa's little helper. And that, that is the correct answer. Good job, Pablo. To nothing, Brandon, it's your spin. Alright, come on, Jokers. Yeah, this is facts. Yes, it's facts. Ugh. Hey. I'll take what I'm usually full of on any given day. Useless facts for a thousand dollars. 
useless facts for one thousand dollars. Here's your question under useless facts. Oh, Brandon, how far does a bowling pin have to tilt to fall down? Again, how far does a bowling pin to fall fall down? Is it A seven degrees, B seven point five degrees, or C thirty degrees? I believe it's 30 degrees. No. Oh, I am sorry. It's not 30 degrees. All right, Will, pick up a thousand if you know the answer. Uh, I can repeat the other two answers. Sure, I will do that, Will. Is it A, 7 degrees, 7.5 degrees? <laughs> Oh, wow. I haven't, bowled, I haven't bowled for ages. I wouldn't know this, but I'll say A7. Oh, I'm sorry. That's also incorrect. Believe it or not, you're just a point five. It's actually 7.5 degrees we were looking for, guys. Ooh. Yep. Uh, still, score still remains five, five or ten, Will. Well, looks like I'm gonna have to use math next time I go bowling. Oh, fuck. We got classical music, classical music! Ah, uh, and who's the Canadian? Alright, uh, I guess a thousand in classical music then. Alright, we'll do that. Classical music for $1,000. Here's your question under the. Oh, the sack butt. Is an ancestor of the modern. Again, the sack butt is, an es is the ancestor of the modern uh, instrument for this one. Is it, is it A, an oboe, B, a trombone, or C, a violin? All right. Uh, you said that kind of fast. Can you spell that name, Sakpa, if you don't mind? Yeah, sure. Sakpa is S A S A C K. B U T sack butt. We're looking. Oh sack butt. Oh god. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, I'll take a guess. I will say the trombone. And you made the right guess. You got it. Well, that is the correct answer. Weird name for instrument. Weird. Ah. Just Fifteen under two, nothing. Your, your spin, Brandon. All right, let's try this again. Here we go. We got a Joker. A triple. It's TV pet. I'll go TV pets for two thousand, please. All right, TV pets for two thousand dollars. Here's your question under TV. All right. Brandon, what was Captain Archer's dog name on Star Trek Enterprise? A Captain Archer's dog name, Star Trek Enterprise. Those, B. Athos or C. Plato. Repeat the choices one more time. Sure. Is it A. Porthos, B. Athos or C. Plato? Was it Portho? Portho is the correct answer. Good job, Brandon. All right. Scores now 2,000 to 1,500. Your spin, Will. For Trek, I, I never watched Enterprise, so maybe I should look up on that sometime. Anyway, look. We got this is fat. Axe. Who's the Canadian? All right. One, one, one thousand useless facts. All right. Useless facts for one thousand dollars. Under useless facts. Oh, where, where was the chip? Where was the chip first made? Is it A, USA, or C, the UK? Oh, God. Repeat the choices one more. 
Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll do that. Is it A, USA, or C, the UK? Oh, all the countries make chips, but hmm. I'll say the good old U.S. of A. I'm not confident, but I'll say A, U.S. No, I'm sorry. That's incorrect. Pick up a thousand if you know the answer. Did you say the question was where were chips first made? I believe it was the U.K. No, it's not the UK, Brandon. Believe it or not, it was actually France. Huh. <laughs> Excuse me. You learn something new every day. Okay, fun fact for this one, that is where they got the name French fries. That being said, score still remains 2,500. Your spin, Brandon. All right, let us get some good jokers. Come on. Work the first time. Let's try it again. TV pets for two thousand, please. TV pets for two thousand. Question under TV pets. All right. And then, what was the name of Barney Rubble's dog on the Flintstones? What was the name of Barney Rubble's dog on the Flintstones? Is it A. Dino, B. Hoppy, or C. Rex? I believe it was Hoppy. Hoppy is the correct answer. Good job. All right. Scored 4,500. Well, you need to catch up on this one. You don't say. All right. Let's, let's go. We got bodies. A joker and a triple. Two grand American states. All right, American States for $2,000. Question under American States. Well, which state is known as the Peach State? Which state is known as is B, Florida, or C, Georgia? If I don't get this, Steve Harvey would never let me on this episode of Family Feud. And and Brandon, you would probably laugh and shoot me. It is C, Georgia. Let's move on. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I, I wouldn't laugh at you. I would just say thank you for giving me the win, but nonetheless. All right. Scores now 4,000 to 3,500. All right. Let's see if we can get the win right here. Come on, Jokers. For that reason, since you got the same category for three times, you going to get an dollars. What'd you say? I'm sorry, I didn't, couldn't hear you. Well, the three of the same category, you get a natural. You get an extra dollar for that. Nice. You must go for that. Useless facts for two thousand dollars and the game. Yes. However, if you get this question wrong, to steal and also win the game to become the new champion. All right, two thousand dollars, and and for the for the game. Here we go. How fast can a crocodile run? Can a crocodile run? Miles, even eleven miles, or see ten miles. What was the first choice again? Twelve miles. All right. 
Wow. Um. I'm gonna say a crocodile can run as fast as. Mm, Ten miles an hour. Ten miles an hour is incorrect. All right, but well, you did get this quest right. X, you you will win the game and become the new champion. All right. What were the other two choices? All right. Sure. A, 12 miles per hour, or C, 11 miles per hour. <coughs> okay. Never went to Florida in my life to understand. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I would say the last one, 12 miles per hour. 12 miles per hour is... Also incorrect. I am sorry, Will. Eleven miles an hour. Hmm. Well, I've never know that. We're in the we're in the one part book, you guys, but your only one was eleven miles an hour. But here's another fun fact: for this one can't stick out, can't stick their tongues out for that. Hmm. All right. On this one, the score still remains four thousand thirty-five hundred. Your spin will. I mean, they were going to afford it to the Everglades if I see one of them. Right, right to the middle. Here's the tape. Here's the tape. Patience. And a nice trip along the way. Wow. Yeah. Thousand dollars as well. Did you hit all three of the same category each for that? You okay. Uh, okay. I don't know many quotations, but let's go. All right. All right here, here we go. You get this question right under humorous quotations. Get, you'll get $5,500, enough to win the game, but however, Brandon will get one final spin at it. All right. All right. Potentially to win the game on this one, $50,000. Well, who said to err is human, but it feels to. Again, who said to err, that's E R R, err, is human? Divine. Is it A. Mae West, B. Dorothy Parker, or C. Bette Midler? Okay, I'm sorry. You were like. Really okay. <laughs> I start. Can you guys hear me again? Yeah. Yeah. If I can hear you. Okay. 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 Sorry about that. I passed the data area. Just repeat. Just repeat the question one, one more time. I heard something about divine, and then everything else just cut. Cut. I I apologize for that one, but I will. All right. All right. Err, that's E R R, but it feels divine. Said to err is human, but it feels divine. So are A Mae West, B Dorothy Parker, or C Beth Midler? Okay, that is that. <laughs> wow, I. Wow. 
I have that. I don't. I can't say that I know this. I don't think I know this one. Ah, uh, uh, well. Sorry about. And nope. if you get this under human quotations, you win the game and you still remain as champion if you know this answer. Is it Bet Midler? No, that's incorrect. Supernaut was made West. If you're looking for guys. That was my second guess. Should have went the other way. Oh, sorry about that. Brandon, but still remain 4,3500. All right, let's go get some jokers. Here we go. We got a joker, TV pads, and humorous quotations. Dub, TV pets for the win, please. dollars If you do get this question right under TV pets, and will still remain as champion. However, yeah. will have cha- will stay alive for this one. All right, for a thousand dollars for TV pets. Here we go. All right, in Beretta's pet cockatoo. In Beretta's pet cockatoo is it A P or C Fred? I repeat that. I want you to name Beretta's pet cockatoo. Okay. Name Beretta's pet cockatoo. Pete or C. Fred. I heard Pete and Fred is the two choices. What was the third? Uh, uh Pete. Doesn't love- I asked from the the usual from Sesame Street. Hmm. I'll go with Pete. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. That's incorrect. Pick up a thousand if you know this answer. Down the choice of the other two. I'll take a stab at it. I'll say four. And they're nicely done, Will. Okay. Forty-five hundred to four thousand. Very good game in this one. Well, it was then. Wow. People have cockatoos on these shows? Hmm. Only Maggie. Here we go. Got American States, just as facts, and a joke. <sighs> that was American States. All right. If you get this question right under American States, you'll have $5,500, enough for you to win the game. But however, like I mentioned, we'll get one final spin at it. thousand dollars under American states is Louis Louisiana state flower is the what again is the what is it egg magnola e Cherokee rose I repeat the choice of the words I do a cut here we go is it B or Steve Cherokee Rose. Okay, I heard I heard all three this time. Actually, I do know this one. It's A Magnolia. And you get fit. Well, good job. All right, Brandon. There are two. We need to get or three jokers to do it. Stop. Rather than. Hey, rather than triple or three jokers, I'll have a new champion. All right. Well, here goes nothing. Come on, jokers. All right. Uh, lots of music. Nope. Can't do it. 
and Will's new champion. Good game, sir. Well done. And those questions, so made my brain here. Good game. Good game, Brendan. Mm-hmm. Well, <sighs> Will, we're going to talk to you in just a moment. It was a good but unfortunately, a couple questions cost you anyway. At the end of though, you're $1,752, and a thanks for playing. Mm -hmm. As always. And guys, we're going to take a commercial break on this one, and when we come back, it's that rabbit right there. Right, welcome back to the Joker as well. And Will is our brand new champion with a total of ten thousand five hundred dollars. And he'll now face Lucy the Devil. And let's go ahead and bring that down the prize board. So there are some good prizes. Joker's right there. You keep, you, there. you keep, on, keep on going. Second spin. And then, if you still have that Joker, then you can have a chance at a brand new car. Set. Well, go ahead and spin. Uh, yeah. I know this score was messed up on my end as well, so. Technical difficulties, you just gotta love them. Go ahead and spin it. Uh, all right, awesome. What's up, the Joker with ten thousand dollars? T Grand Piano worth nine thousand dollars, and another one this time the console piano worth three thousand three hundred ninety-five dollars. Price package still comes up to twenty-two thousand dollars, and you earn a bonus spin. Yay, pianos. <laughs> and Brandon Scrubs go on tour. Yeah, you learn how to tickle. There we go. <laughs> That'd be it for you. We're $4,735. Plus a trip to Portugal, $5,066. Plus a computer cabinet dealt pensum. Five thousand one eighty six. Comes up to thirty seven thousand five hundred sixty eight dollars. And no, I'm not giving you a dollar. Unfortunately. With that being said, game. Face, face loose. To the, excuse me. Well, there's some cash now for between two and. $50. If the, the Joker comes up any time, you you get a thousand dollars Joker bonus no matter what happens along the way. And by the way, you can stop at any time, no matter you can stop at any time if you're afraid of Lucy. The that said, during your first doing in your during the after the two spin, excuse me thousand dollars for the joker's jackpot but however doing the first two spins got up to eighty thousand dollars that being said will you can go ahead and spin it all right since pressing enter on any desk here is still a little bit when I multi press so i can get the game going so it should trigger any moment first I said it should trigger. Thank you. Okay, there you go. You got two thousand. Oh, almost there. You almost stop. That's fucked up right there. Now we got two thousand dollars right now. Plus the two hundred and fifty dollars. What do you want to do? You want to stop or go?
All right, Will, you want to stop or go? I, I said we'll continue. We'll continue on from there. Sorry about that. Some technical issues on my end as well. That's just me. Well, to do it, and it's it's your last chance at that double jokers jackpot. Right. Sorry about that. Hitting dead, hitting dead. Business, but... <sighs> oh, so we oh, almost have. I'm in a bad area. I said I would continue. Not bad. Okay. You'll continue on? Five. Yeah, let's go. We're going, going all the way until I get 10000 or Lucy pops up. Let's go. All right, here we go. All I need is 3250 to do it. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. Almost had the river. Let's go. Right, he's going. All he needs is twenty five hundred to do it. Think about taking the money, Will. Plus, we add that Joker's bonus to that. That's $14,750 to it. And we add your previous winnings to that. We'll give you a cash amount total of $1,250. Of All right. All right, did everybody have a good time? Yeah. I, I want to play the what if game. I want to know if Lucy would have been in my final spin had I caught on. <laughs> mm. And unfortunately, it's not the real show, sir. I know, I know. I was only pulling the strings. I, I know. I know what you're saying, Will. <laughs> oh, guys, that being 
said, that's going to do this for this episode of The Joke as well. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I did. And if you like The Joke as well, season one, episode number six, give this a thumbs up. And please like this video. And if you're brand new, please subscribe. And also, not station bell. Under my name, Brandon Mark. Perhaps you'll never miss an upload live stream. And do not forget this for the Joker's Wild well, Season 1. Any episodes from that? Uh, I will be right back. That's fine, Will. Well, with that being said, I am your host, Brandon Martin, saying thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I'll see you guys next time. For the next episode of The Joker's Wow. Braden Scruggs speaking for The Joker's Wild, a Braden Martin presentation in association with MVG Productions.